Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our flawless run. We're trying to play through Legendary Iron Man, War of the Chosen, Unmodded and try to win every mission, lose zero soldiers and matter of fact try to not get hit in the process. Operation Choking Cavern is another advent retaliation. Chrysalids, Gatekeeper, which uh, is a little bit bad. Uh, the Heavy Mech, which is bad as well. So all of this makes up for quite a bit of a difficult mission. But thankfully we got a good team, the B slash C team. No, it's actually the B team. The M and Wilson, Ripper and Lance, and Inappropriate Murphy has now shifted to the B team. And we put uh, Synapse in here as well. Got uh, some uh, rounds against uh, against humanoids. Uh, armor penetration is always uh, good, and got quite a bit of blue screen rounds. Given that we do have problems with the gatekeeper, um, might as well do that and go with more blue screen rounds. Alright, let's go. Alright, so that's a long street map. Luckily for us, we do have the absolute right scout for all of that. Hmm, nothing. Those of you who have a those of you who have a grappling hook go close to the ledge here so that we can use uh, the high ground Got it. Copy that. so what are we dealing with That is very far. Oh no. Chrysalis, uh, chrysalids are starting to repopulate. Not good. Moving further. Affirmative. Moving quickly. Moving very much Moving further. On. Second round in a row that we're just Already sprinting. On the move. Which is crazy if you think about it, because typically you can't get too full. Uh, yellow moves in without triggering anything. Okay, there is the gatekeeper. And unfortunately, we lost our second civilian. Hmm. Okay, I need to engage without kind of running into the chrysalids like an idiot. Okay, couple of chrysalids there. That's a decent start. I can handle that. All right, bring it on. Thank you. They never cease to amaze with their rather simple mind um, moves to there
Get a fantastic hit off. Two, four, six, eight, kill. Death from above. Thank you. And with a chosen weapon, this is going to be very, very entertaining. Good. Chrysalid's down. Got some more enemies. Okay, and I think we got a good position. Let's rock. Free reload, and they will move, so we'll get some overwatch shots out of it. Did that hit? It did. Looks like hostiles over here. Oh wow, yet another pack. This is strange port placement. Very, very tightly packed. Trap worked out like a charm. Lots of chrysalids. And let's use some fire to make them some chrysalids. <laughs> okay, here we go. Heavy mech. Down. Chrysalid. Down. Let's trigger this pack. Wilson is ready. So is the pack. Interesting positioning. Run gun, advanced teamwork. Two, four, six, eight, no, not enough yet.
Let's hit the gatekeeper. Come on, focus. Come on. Compromised. Yeah, well, decent avoidance. I give him that. I think we're going to use Comet Presence to help Wilson mark the target again and shred it. Okay, well, that was the third time that he missed. There is only so much you can do in this case. Let's soften the gatekeeper up. I'm going. Shot wide. Good simply wasn't working out, in which case a protocol with threat assessment. So once the thing moves, we get another chance for a shred and here you go. Take that mimic beacon and be happy. Wilson, what is wrong with you? Gave you a good gun and you just treated it like crap. Okay, need to get away from the car there. And uh, this here is just for security purpose, in case anything happens. We do have Salvo, I didn't need that action and... I did have Salvo. Oh, come on. All right, played too long with too many mods because Salvo in the mods worked very well with Mimic Beacons. Well, we can still do it without him. Comet Penis is unfortunately off.
whiplashing into the mech. Very nice. I wanted to be extra smart with uh, that mimic beacon. Get the gatekeeper for good. Did you see that one? Fantastic. Keep going. Right in the margin. Hmm. Down to one HP. We need some extra damage. I'll take three actions wherever I can. That's a stun. Moves over. Running and gunning. Let's hit this guy. The face is one. That's a kill. And that's a kill as well. Cleared out everything. There's still a chrysalid here. Alright, I think that was a free reload, yep. Set up that chrysalid. Could have done it ourselves. And saved an action with the skirmisher. But it's alright. to grab her to the other uh, field but apparently that is impossible continuing death from above
That's a hit. That's a kill. And since the next reload would actually rec uh, end our turn, I would rather face off. Fabulous. Not too shabby. Understood. Moving out. Locked Reload Overwatch. We still got free uh, free reloads and we're just going to put this here out draws out any borrowed chrysalids in case there are some left and overwatch Okay, well that at least was a hit. And there you go. Finally went down. Menace one five status confirmed. We're not picking up any additional contacts. The AO is clear. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Strange mission. Very strange. Typically you uh, the the packs do not cluster up like that. The map was completely void of anything in the first part and then you run into like what six packs at once Wilson gets chain shot movement across the globe good we can continue to upgrade bonds they are actually working very well at this point getting some more intel that's not much that uh, we can upgrade we're pretty much uh, full force all we need is a bond on two of our main characters but that will happen it very soon in the meantime other bonds improve our people seem to work well together and we got one uh, superior not sure what it is we're going to find out 
So, uh, Stormwalker and Snake. No. No, 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 no. Stormwalker and the kit, and the kit is almost ready. We're going to wait out. I want that bond. Commander, we should make use of the ring facility and deploy our idle soldiers on a covert action with the resistance. Still tired. Finally, good. So we want Stormwalker and the kit. I'll order my people to get underway immediately. And then we had a couple of promotions that we could get also out of uh, out of missions. In the meantime, uh, I want that to be countered. Oh, that's even worse. All right, return fire. Elite Spectre, Heavy Mech, Gatekeeper. Okay, we need plenty of, of blue screen rounds here. And we need to do a facility soon. So in terms of leveling, We still need to level parts of team number one. And whilst we're at it, might as well put inappropriate Murphy there. Good, not a bad team. We got superior focus out of all of the superior PCSs. This is so troll. Buddy, listen. No, no. Roro is here and he has the right to get the Devastator. And also the Rage Suit, which really worked well so far. We could use a better heavy weapon, but I can build that. This is good. Uh, this is good. Let's give Wilson something else to work with. You know, just out of curiosity, what are the options? Superior hair trigger, superior skull. Oh, wow. It's actually not bad. Hmm. Which weapon could we use that on? I like the superior laser sight here because we want to crit as often as possible. I guess, to be entirely honest, 
this is as good of, uh, of a weapon as any. So this is an L shape. We got some high ground here and here, which we might use for our advantage. <clears throat> if you have played long enough, you know all of uh, the little building blocks. There is the high ground I was talking about. Yeah, moves over. We can easily uh, grapple ourselves up. Will do. Double time. Good. On Overwatch. This mission is not going to last nine turns. It's going to be fast and very furious. Good start or good option for a nice double whammy start. Opens up all of that so that we can look into the area. Vipers are immediately down. The Spectre kind of does Spectre things. Okay, with Roro being spotted out, no problem. Aggressively moving forward. Position confirmed. It's going to be fun. And yeah, we're just going to stay here for now. Not a surprise, to be honest. Fire's getting close here. This will trigger all of them. All right. 
right, bring it on. Heavy mag. of elite trooper okay and let's start to clean this up hit. Fantastic reposition. Move. Moves to here. And whilst we're at it, removal of cover. Continuing the cleanup. Free reload. Face this one down. You know that was good. Checking out where the rest of the enemies might be. Oh, should have done run and gun. Never mind, never mind. This could be a kill. Or not. In which case I'm mimic beaconing it. No point in wasting too many of uh, our resources. The priest is a uh, annoying companion anyway, so we're We'll have to deal with him one way or the other. Good, that gives us the hack that we were looking for. 
This time we can run and gun. Trigger the gatekeeper. Let's see if we can freeze the gatekeeper. Nope. That's a solid miss. Good. Let's see how far Banish will take the Gatekeeper down. I hope it at least shreds it completely. Oh, it's good. I can't let that happen again. The shadows say that. Pretty damn good. On the high ground here, we got everything very nicely inside. Whatever you say. Good. One. Enemy down. Shot failed to connect. Gatekeeper okay, needs to take some more damage, which I think we can. help with there we go free reload Alright, Overwatch, Overwatch, and we're good. Told you it's not going to take 8 rounds. We came in hot and heavy. Good. That was a 
easy and relatively straightforward mission. To be fair though, with uh, the hunter with a chosen rifle, it's just crazy. Advanced conditioning. Finally, something somewhat meaningful. Um, not that it matters too much because we're trying to not get hit in the first place, but okay. Continue to scan for into. Almost done with the sector port uh, breakthrough, which will give us Gremlins rank three. I think you will find our results have exceeded expectations. Central claims to have seen one of these things up close back in the day. Um, three autopsy here. Hell, we've good. And now we do have shotguns plus one damage. That is awesome. Particular specimen on board the ship. I will make that our highest. Priority. Experimental powered weapon. I think we're focusing on that. Sounds good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. Getting two of them because of uh, the rage suit. And started, Commander. then I think we got an upgrade here. Very nice. And we could now build Hellweave Wests, which. Don't really need. I probably could have saved a lot of time repairing the ship's systems if we had... Don't get me wrong, they are not bad, but we're not trying to get hit in the first place. So in this particular run, not as good as in other runs. Can't build anything else that is meaningful. Okay, nothing happening there. That's irrelevant, maybe. And let's see what else we get. Hmm. Also not nece necessarily... Good, that is fantastic. I think I need to do an alien facility very soon. Unfortunately. I suppose since that worked, we might as well keep it up, Commander. We've got a shot at hitting the elders hard. Okay, so what do we have? Um, you want more, here. Reduce avatar progress might not be a bad idea. Well, that is okay. That isn't bad either. There's nothing that is like striking me. Do we have a promotion somewhere? Yeah, potentially that'll uh, that'll be our run. We want to promote the soldiers. Good, both of them are at least Bond level one. Nothing to write home about, but okay. So the, new uniform is the last thing that we want to do, bef do well, whilst day. we're doing the Golden Path missions, what we want to do is we want to get Ghost, 8.5, Stormwalker and Roro basically up to uh, the highest rank. What uh, we definitely need to do since Roro is so far behind is get the supplies Roro 
and your bond mate is Vega. Okay. And that's where we are forced to pick a facility. It's going to be this one here. Setting course for Sector 2, Australia. We'll do some reduce uh, progress. Just so that that problem does not occur anytime soon. But yeah, this is going to happen in the next episode, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Really appreciate that if you enjoyed the Flawless Run so far. And leave a comment and a like down below and let me know uh, what you think about the two missions that you've just witnessed. Take care and have a good one. Bye-bye.